In this video, I'm going to cover how you can download and activate software available to you as an information systems student. In order to do this, you'll need to go to the Azure portal. The link is aka.ms forward slash dev tools for teaching. From here, you'll choose to sign in, log in with your university ID at umail.utah.edu then press next. Choose to stay signed in if that works best for you or choose no if you don't want to stay signed in. From here, you have access to cloud computing resources, free software, as well as an initial $100 credit from Azure. In order to take advantage of the software, choose Download Software. From here, you can search for the software you're looking for or search for it in the list. Let's look for Project. I'll choose Project. And from here, I can download MS Project. But what about the activation key? If we scroll down just a bit, if we were to press this button, this would generate a key that would help us activate that software. Microsoft Office also has different versions. Some of them are known as click to run. If you notice that you have any problems installing your Office software, in addition to project or anything else that you may need, you may need to uninstall your regular Office suite. I recommend that you save your activation key so you can reinstall the software later if you need it or use it on another computer. In order to get a compatible version of Office, navigate to, in a new tab, o365cloud.utah.edu. Choose to log in. Since we've already logged in, we'll stay signed in. And up at the top right here, we'll see a button that says Install Office. From here, we'll choose Office 365 Apps. We'll download Office and install it. This will give you access to a full version of Office that will also be compatible with other software such as MS Project, Visio, etc.